Hey everyone, so in my three years on YouTube, I have never ever done a celebrity inspired tutorial. So today I was getting ready to film some videos because I'm going to Italy um, on the 23rd of September and I needed some videos to have my sister be able to upload them while I'm away so I don't leave you guys hanging. With that said, um, I just bought the new issue of Cosmopolitan, yes I read Cosmopolitan, no it's not a crime for a 16, 16 year old to, wear co to read Cosmopolitan. You know, like if you don't want your 16 year old daughter reading Cosmopolitan, don't let her read it, don't preach to me. I was getting ready and I saw this um, on my bedside table and I was like, you know what? Her makeup is beautiful. This is what her makeup looks like. If you don't know who Minka Kelly is, she is an actress who is in The Roommate with Layden Meester and she was also, um, I think she's in Charlie's Angels. She I just thought her makeup was absolutely gorgeous. Now if you notice she is wearing a yellow shirt, this is the only yellow thing I could find in my mom and my sisters in my closet. It was actually my mom's and I found it last minute. I know it's not the same yellow, but I kind of wanted to give you guys full effect. I know it isn't like a really like nice tank top, but um, this will do. I hope I did it justice. Uh, I'm not like the best person to do inspired tutorials with. <sighs> But I hope I did you guys proud. I'm going to zoom you in to kind of show you the look. Um, this is just what the look looks like. Ignore the mascara spots on my eye. Her eye look is just very natural, very bronzy, very highlighted inner corner. Um, keep in mind that she has a different eye shape than I do. If you notice, her eyes kind of go like inwards. Mine are kind of more round. I'm also not claiming to look like Minka Kelly act like Minka Kelly. I'm just saying that I tried to recreate her makeup look, which is somewhat difficult when you don't even have like a full shot of her eyelid, just like her eyes open. But I hope you guys kind of got the gist of it, um, and I hope I did you guys proud. So let me know what you think, and let me know what more tutorials you'd like me to do, because I actually really like it. So I'll talk to y'all soon. Enjoy this tutorial, and have a great day. Bye. Okay, so I realize I look kind of dead because I'm taking off this ring. It's annoying. Um, because I just did my face makeup. I just used some concealer and powder. All the products I use will be listed in the description down, box down below. I'm doing a tutorial, as I said in the intro, on Minka Kelly's beautiful makeup in the October issue of Cosmopol Cosmopolitan magazine. I was just really inspired by this picture. It's so simple but so beautiful and like glowing and everything. So hopefully we'll be able to achieve that look today. So I'm just going to start off by applying my Urban Decay Primer Potion, which is just a base to keep your shadows not creasing and everything. The colors I'm going to be using are neutral colors. I think it's good to, or kind of like, I don't know if you guys can see this, but she kind of has like almost a smoky eye, but not a smoky eye um, on her lids. And so I'm just going to be using my Indian Wood Paint Pot by MAC, which you can buy at MAC, it's permanent. And I'm just going to be applying that all over my lid and a little bit past my crease. I find like the actual makeup products that um, they used on her, but I couldn't. So, we're working with it. Okay, so I'm using some Inglot shadows that I got a couple weeks ago. I know Inglot can be kind of hard to find, and since it's in the palette, I don't really know how to find the names. I know you can take them out of the palette, but it's kind of hard to do so. Um, I will try and do it and link the colors down below, but basically it's just a shimmery um, beige kind of white color, a kind of grayish brown color, and a dark brown color. I'm just going to go in with the Sigma SS239 brush. They have renamed it, but it's just a flat shader brush for your eyes. I'm going to take a little bit of the beautiful white cream color and apply it to the inner corners. And like the half of the lid. So just like that. We are going to apply more to the inner highlighting at the end. So then to kind of darken up the lid and everything, I'm going to take the middle color, this brownish gray color. This is what it looks like. So you're just going to take that and apply it to... Okay, so once you have the kind of brownish colors on your lid. You just want to make sure and kind of bring it in a little bit more. Then we're going to take this really dark shimmery brown color. This is what it looks like. Um, it's just a really dark color. So anyways, I'm going to take this 230, 224 brush, swirl it in, and we're just going to apply it to the crease. Now Minka also looks like she has kind of darker shadows all over the lid. So it's kind of dark, but if you want to get a more like actual what her makeup looks like, you're just going to put a little... Now that your lids are dark, you're just going to take a 
brush kind of like this. This is what it looks like. It is just a very, I don't know, thin tapered brush. And then go back into this nice champagne color and do some inner corner work. Because Minka has a very highlighted. So the eyes are kind of dramatic. It's kind of hard to see her look, to be honest, but you kind of get the same, oops, my ring. You kind of get the same gist. This is just the eyes. Her eyes are very basic, um, bold brows and bold lashes. So we're going to do brows next. Now, I don't really fill in my brows that often just because I don't really feel like I need to. So I'm just brushing them out. I have this like, like that. And then I'm just going to fill them in slightly with a brow powder. That isn't actually a brow powder, but I use this brow powder. It's the um, Victoria's Secret Very Sexy Eyeshadow in Pose. It's just kind of like a grayish, taupey brown color. I don't know if you're supposed to use this as eyebrow, but um, I just I just do. I mean, what? Eyebrow police going to come after me? No. Mm -mm. So we're just filling in our eyebrows. Um, I'm kind of making them a little bit darker than I normally do, and we're just filling them in as, like this. I kind of feel like a chola. In this picture, Minka is also not wearing very much eyeliner. At all, she just has really bold lashes, but to just kind of define the eyes a little bit more, I'm just taking Max Teddy Eye Cool, and I'm just going to line the upper lash line, um, kind of very deeply, not too precise, just to kind of give it a little bit more definition. Anyways, mascara time, benefits their real mascara. Since my initial reaction video, I found that two coats does the job. Three coats is what makes it clumpy. So, that is what we are doing. Okay, so once you have your eye makeup done, um, you still, you have the eye aspect done of hers. Also, keep in mind that my eye shape is different than Minka's. She is kind of like an inverted, like, on the inside. I don't really think I have that. I don't have it, I don't think. So, her eyes, like, you see, like, they go in, like, really nicely. Like, all the celebrities' eyes do, like, Kim Kardashian. Her eyes kind of point inwards, and they're just beautiful. So, like, her eyes and her eyebrows are different. But the eye makeup is basically the same. So, what we're going to do first is we're going to bronze ourselves. And if you follow me... Or if you've watched my videos for a while, you know the Benefits Hula is my absolute favorite bronzer. It is matte, no shimmer at all, beautiful. Um, just use your favorite bronzer and you'll be good to go. So I just like tap my brush in. And then you're just going to do a three thing like that. Same thing on the other side. Down your nose. And then you also want to go under your neck because you don't want to have like a foundation line because that sucks. Also what we're going to do with the Hoola bronzer is we're going to contour and if you see me looking at the screen it's because I'm doing my makeup in the screen. I'm not doing it like with a mirror or anything. I'm doing it in the screen of my camera. Okay so we're just going to contour a little bit. Not that much though. She also has a lot of blush on her face, um, I mean not to the point where it's like too much but she does have some blush on her face and to me it looks like a very plummy blush and so when I want a plummy blush I go for Dalit. Suck in your cheekbones because you want to give the illusion like you have really high cheekbones like Minka and apply it to your... And as our last, almost last and final step. We're going to be putting on a very nice lip color that's kind of like my lips but better color. It's like a nude but not like death nude. It's like a color like your lips but better. I thought about Viva Glam 5 by um, MAC which goes to AIDS and everything and this seems like a really good option. And I wouldn't be surprised if this is the actual color they used. So um, it just looks like that. It's a very nice nudish kind of color. So that's that with the lipstick. And then if you want you can add a little bit of gloss. This is just Revlon's. Color, bur color Burst in 
8 Peony, Peony, whatever. It just kind of is like a similar color concept. And just put it on. Rub your lips together. So that is that. It is my first celebrity inspired makeup tutorial. Keep in mind that it is hard to like recreate eye makeup looks if their eyes are open and you can't find any pictures of them in the magazine. Let's see if I can find. Um, you can kind of see it a little bit more again in here. It's just kind of very natural, pretty, flawless look. You could even probably get away with just doing one eyeshadow all over the lid and it's fine. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope I didn't let you guys down. I know you guys asked to see more tutorials, so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I really like this look. I think it's really pretty, really natural. Um, not too heavy at all. I think it just looks really good and classic. So let me know what you all think, and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.